You're frustrated. It's summer and temperature is going up? Drink more water. Not feeling well? Drink more water. The secret to a healthier life? Drink more water. So now you're pulling your hair out, trying to bribe your guinea pig to drink just a little bit more water. But they don't care and leave you worried and devastated and rethink your whole existence. Okay, that was a bit dramatic, but you get the idea. Welcome or welcome back to the IT Cinnamon channel. And in this video, I'm going to walk you through some tips to encourage your guinea pigs to drink more water. As usual, more info and an article format will be linked in the description. Also, I want to put a quick disclaimer. I am not a medical professional, and if you feel like something is off with your guinea pig, please take it to the vet. Without further ado, let's dive in. How much water does your guinea pig need? Guinea pigs should drink about 100 milliliters or 3.3 ounces of water every day per pig. However, they can drink anywhere from 15 milliliters to 300 milliliters a day, depending on their diet, activity, environment, and age. Guinea pigs who are sick, pregnant, just had surgery, and hot weather, and only have access to dry food should be drinking more water. Water is crucial for all living things, and guinea pigs are no exception. They should have easy and limited access of fresh, clean water every day. Now, when your guinea pig suddenly isn't drinking water, but other than that, they show no signs of illness, let's go over this list to fix this first. 1. The container. Is the water bottle or water bowl new? Check their water bottles. Can they drink from it? Is it leaking? Is the metal drinking ball thing stuck? 2. The water. Did you change the source of your water? As in, were you usually giving your pet yeast tap water and you changed it to distilled today? Now look closely at the water. Are there any particles in there? Do you change the water every single day? Even if you do, I recommend you to deep clean the entire bottle. I use these metal straw cleaners to clean it and I'll put the link in the description. Do you add anything to your guinea pig's water? like liquid vitamin C supplements. Because I used to use them, but we all know that it has a huge smell and guinea pigs don't like it. I suggest omitting the liquid vitamin C unless it's vet prescribed and replace it with vitamin C tablets instead. Three, the placement. Is the water bottle placed too high or too low? Can they access the bottle easily? If the bottle is hard for a guinea pig to drink, they will stop drinking. And if you're using a water bowl, do they tip it over? So we're going to fix these things first. And usually they're very quick and easy to fix. But if you're not sure how to, I put more detailed instructions in our article version. So please check it out. Now you've checked out all of these things and maybe your guinea pig is just not a fan of drinking water and like ever. Here's how to encourage your potato to get more H2O. 1. Place multiple water bottles in different places. Guinea pigs have different preferences in water bottles, so having different kinds of it helps too, whether if you only have one guinea pig or ten. That's because sometimes guinea pigs will claim one water bottle as their own. Putting them in different places, especially placing one near their eating area, can encourage your guinea pigs to drink more water as they pass by. Just like humans, you're more likely to drink water if it's right beside you than if it's 10 feet away. Because we're lazy. 2. Wash your veggies before eating. We all know it's mandatory to wash your veggies before feeding your guinea pigs, but hear me out. Sometimes we pre-chop the vegetables and store them in a fridge, and that's completely fine. However, veggies tend to lose some water content due to that. So before you feed your potatoes, rinse your chopped veggies through the water again and don't shake the excess water off. This will add more water content to your vegetables. Trust me, the water content adds up. 3. Don't disturb your guinea pig when it's drinking. I don't know about you, but my guinea pigs get distracted very easily, especially when they're drinking water. When they see me or hear a noise, they will leave their water bottles and go to the sound source for me. 
To avoid that, try not to make any noise and leave your guinea pigs be when they are drinking water. Wait until they walk away from their water bottles first before interacting with them. Key point. Wait until they walk away. That's because guinea pigs often take breaks between sips, sometimes to groom or rest. So in similar terms, don't distract them. 4. Feed them cucumbers. The classic, but it works. Cucumbers are around 96% water. They're delicious and a great vegetable for guinea pigs because it's also low in sugar and calcium. Other vegetables and fruits that are also high in water content but low in calcium include celery, lettuce, and tomatoes. And that leads us to the final tip, number five. Make your own cocktail for guinea pigs. Cocktail or juice, you choose. But I created this recipe for guinea pig owners who are trying to get their guinea pigs to drink more water without forcing them. This juice is easy to make and only requires three ingredients cucumbers, celery, and water. This recipe is very effective and fun to make and my guinea pigs drank the entire bottle in just 24 hours. So these are some tips to encourage your piggies to drink more water. Let me know how it worked for you in the comments and if you have any more tips to share. If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe for more. Thanks for watching till the end and I'll see you next time. Bye!